Hi, are you uh, you Chris? Chris? Chris, yeah, hop on in. We have, uh, I have gum, uh, mints, anything you want for the trip. Yeah, Do you like talking during the ride or not talking? Uh, I set it off, but I guess I'll put it on. Oh, Do you, have, so you have climate control? It's a little hot. Yeah, one second here. Got it. All right. Thanks. We're all set. All right. All right, so are you here, you're here to see, uh, are you a fan of one of the bands here? Yeah, I uh, try to go as often as I can to the festivals. I just, uh, I don't know. I don't really get to come out of my show much in my corporate job, so. Oh, what do you do? Uh, finance. Finance? Yeah. That's incredible. And then big you, numbers guy. Big numbers guy. And then you guys, you can sort of cut, well, there's a lot of number bands here. There's Avenged Sevenfold. Sure. That's yeah. a big number band. Yep. Uh, I don't think Seven Dust is here. But, uh, and certainly not Blink-182, but a lot of those bands <laughs> are here. Have you ever seen uh, some of the more like darker bands, some of the spookier bands? Uh, yeah, I, uh, I like Ice Nine Kills. Oh, That's they're all, fantastic. I'll say that, yeah. I saw them on tour last year with Black Elk Brides. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, and I think a tray, I think I, it was a, I think I was yeah. the entire bill. I don't something remember. Something about three or some, something, I don't there know. There was more, another, more numbers. More uh, numbers. Trinity, Trinity, yeah. Trinity of Terror, yeah. uh, incredible. Yes. Yep. Incredible. Well, good time. I didn't stay for the uh, for the one band. Uh, something about some color. I like numbers. I don't like colors. So. Yeah, they sort of you know they sort of spooked me out a little. They had a lot of uh, face paint, and they also had um, um, dancers. Yeah. That I saw. I yeah. believe uh, members of the Cherry Bombs. Honestly, I think that stuff should be left in the pop world. I mean, bands, rock bands, trying to bring in. They should rock. So yeah, I mean, bringing in dancers to give people the show that that they paid for and something cool and extra that's different from everything else that they see on the on the stage like should be left in the pop world I, dancers and rock I, I i agree and is this is your first time here at welcome to rockville uh in daytona yes i've been to the one in jacksonville but uh here we are at daytona i'm uh, also a big nascar fan oh my god yeah. well you know number three he passed away right over there the legend the legend in fact you know i probably shouldn't do this because you know as you know i'm just a, an uber driver sure but I think if we play our cards right, we're gonna go onto the track and check that out here. And I, so let's see if we get yelled at here, but. I wanna hit the bank at as fast as this puppy can well, go. This thing, <laughs> if you touch that button, there's a, nit there's a nitrous this button This is the here. Fast and the Furious button? This is, yeah, okay, this is, uh, it was actually rigged up by Vin Diesel <laughs> uh, himself here. But, All right, here we go. But that is, my understanding is that is where Mr. Uh, number wow. three, we lost number three on that turn over there, which, is, which is which is pretty good. Well, you know, I, I hope this doesn't affect my Uber rating that I just sort of took you out of your way. It's okay, we got to see the uh, spot where legends become icons or something like that. People that, or people that just drive very fast. Yeah. Um, if you could tell all your friends, where are you from, by the way? From uh, Scranton, Pennsylvania. Ah! Yep. Great pretzels out there. Perhaps you've uh, seen The Office. Yes. Maybe. Yeah, Michael Scott, you know. Oh my God. Do you know him? I don't know. Uh, we've never had the chance to meet, but I do use. Uh, I would love to. I've never had a celebrity in my Uber, so I would no, love to. No. I would love to sort of meet somebody. Yeah, I, I, uh, I get a little. I get a little shy around celebrities. How would so. you describe this? festival to your friends that are not here today uh i would say that this is the best festival that i've been to of all the danny Weimer festivals because i personally like it hot like it sticky and oh. here in florida i get everything plus all the rock it's uh it's pretty much my favorite. I like incarceration and uh, a couple of the others. You like being in prisons? I do. I really. I spent. Some, I did some time for uh, some finance stuff. If you know what I'm saying. Oh, so you're a. You're more. I feel like you're trying to come off as a street criminal, but I think we know that you're. You're, you're more of a white collar. Yeah, yeah. Wall Street stuff. You Wall know? Street stuff. Yeah. Well, yeah. you'll get bailed out, and you'll you'll be. Uh, Somehow they keep hiring me. I don't know. You'll be safe. Yeah. Well, you know, my, my final question is, is I heard Motionless and White are playing here later today. That's what their name is, yeah. Motionless and White, yes. thank you. Yes. Yeah, and I was okay. wondering if you had any, um, you know, strong opinions on that band and anything you wanted to say to them. Uh, I mean, we already established that dancers should stay out of rock. Let's dancers stick with that. Dancers should stay out of rock, I mean, yep. Definitely. And makeup? I, what, yeah, what you, the, makeup? 
The Cherry Bombs definitely aren't the best group of women and the most like awesome, badass group of women Not good. that exists right now in the touring rock world. Not at all. Uh, as far as Motionless and White, uh, I would say, what's up with the paint and playing in the sunlight? What's up with that? Yeah, Maybe well, you lose like, the paint. Who are they hiding Maybe from? What are they, what are they hiding time. from? I don't. Yeah, there's I don't secrets really there. get it. I, I don't know. There's secrets. Well, I also uh, noticed you have a, an amazing Judgment Day T-shirt on. I do. One of the greatest current wrestling factions. Yes. Uh, around rumors that there will be a new member introduced soon. I yeah, heard this. Yeah. Who do you think should be the next member of the Judgment Day if they get to induct a new member? Oh boy. Well, uh, I'd say the first person I think of is probably somebody from that motionless white band. Feel really? like, uh, yeah, they. Uh, you got do, do you, the vibe, you know. You think that I've seen those guys, and you really think they can wrestle? They look a little. <laughs> yeah, uh, the, uh, if thin, look, thin to me, maybe. Yeah, if they're looking for more like the uh, smaller, uh, like the guys hype who lose. Guy, yeah, like they need they need a hype guy, and they need I feel someone like, to eat all the pins. Yeah, that's what I've said. Like someone that like kind of like the shorter vibe to make the rest of them look taller. So like so anybody emotionless could definitely pull that off. I love that. Well, I think we're almost here. Uh, I'm going to drop you off, but uh, it would mean the world to me uh, if you could give me a really uh, good uh, Uber rating. Okay. Um, I five think it's on a it scale is. to one to five, so sure. I, I, I don't want to put any pressure on you, but like, can you kind of let I know I'm not going to see you after I hop, we hop out, so yeah, yeah. what would be my Uber rating uh, from scale one to five? Oh, five stars. This conversation was great. And uh, I've also got a business card for you. Oh my uh, god. I'm not a chef, but I certainly know how to cook some books, if you know what I'm saying. That I do. Sir, <laughs> Chris, was it? Chris. Chris. Pleasure. Enjoy the concert. Pleasure. Uh, I'll see you. At the, uh, I'm going to go check out Motionless White later, so hopefully I'll see you there. Hell yeah. Even though they said they suck. I'll be there. We'll go check them out. All right. All right see Chris. you later, sir. A pleasure, man. Good luck. Enjoy your concert. Are you uh, Jake? Are you my next ride?